Hello friends, today's daily devotional is more on creating the relationship you want. So last night I was talking with a very dear friend who was going through some relationship trouble and he, a lot of what he was saying was wondering how to honor himself and the kind of relationship that he was wanting to create by putting up boundaries and um, really kind of pushing back or pushing away from um, his lover, the person he was in relationship with. And a lot of the comments were around wanting the other person to change or wishing that they were different or not knowing how to handle the other person being different and wanting something different than what he wants and wanted. And I shared with him the, uh, the power of sovereignty and the power of letting go and the power of drawing our energy back inside ourselves and reconnecting with that. And I also shared with him one of the tenets of life lift, which is all untruths dissolve in the presence of the truth. And so in the context of relationship, when we allow ourselves to simply connect with our own inner truth that doesn't involve anyone else or anything outside of ourselves, it's actually a truth of oneness within, right? And so in order to get there, we got to take full responsibility for everything we feel like we don't have, everything that we feel like is lacking, and to f- feel and tune into the pain of that and simply let it be here. There, there honestly is nothing to do with it, nothing to fix, nothing to prove, nothing to reach for, nothing to grasp. It's all here. And when you stop running and you stop forcing and you stop fighting, then you drop down into that, that resonance that it really is all here. Everything that I could want to be, everything that I could hope to have, the energy of it is, is here and is available to me. And so when you simply own and feel that pain of lacking or loss fully, everything drops away and we come into that quiet, still, peaceful sense of self, right? And in that oneness, in that truth, we are inspired in how to express that in our lives. And perhaps it is this relationship isn't working or isn't in alignment. Uh, Perhaps that is a revelation or perhaps we see a part of ourselves that we wasn't taking responsibility for before in the way that we were showing up with the other person. So whatever the outcome may be, you can know that you are living in your truth, right? And when we're living in our truth, it actually creates a field of resonance around us, a field of resonance in our in our bodies to where we don't need to change anyone else. Our energy field automatically invites them into that same resonance and then they are empowered to choose whether or not they want to be in that resonance field. Right? And they're either in resonance with the truth as well, that you are sharing in a oneness state, or they're, they're not. And if they're not, then they'll be repelled from your energy field. So all untruths dissolve in the presence of the truth. I talk about this a lot when people ask me about energy protection, or how do I protect myself from unwanted energies, or unwanted you know beings, or anything like that. And the truth is, it's so much more powerful to me to put your focus on what you're radiating. And if you are radiating the truth of oneness, then there's absolutely nothing to be protected from. So that then even if something seemingly malicious was attacking you or coming at you, that energy is just going to fade or dissolve in your energy field. Right. So practice with that today. What would it be like to just live the fullness of truth, to consider that you really are not apart from anyone else or anything else and to let things unfold as they may when you're instead of putting your focus on how can I protect how can I put up that boundary how can I put up that wall how can I push that away from me no I don't like that I don't want that how can you simply put your energy into what it is that you do want who it is that you really feel that you are what it is that brings those good feelings to you and notice how your relationship transforms notice how Um, When you stop trying to change another person, how they're invited to simply be in their truth, and then you can really see clearly, wow, is this in alignment or is it not? And it can give you the courage to accept whatever answer uh, may come. Enjoy this today. Much love.